Get Get ready for the countdown. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Hello? What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing? Here we go. Just a second, guys. I'm trying to fix some stuff, so just give me a moment. Oops. Can you guys see that all right? guys what is up
so we are streaming um, SmackDown vs. Raw 2006. We're going to be doing the GM mode. Um, I figured we would do it this way um, just because we kind of get our foot in the door. Um, Broken Sanity, thank you for the follow. It's not playing the original. Burn it down! There it goes. So apparently it's going to do twice, one with the overlay and then the one that I have set up. So sorry for that, guys. But Broken Sanity, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Marksman Army. Much appreciated. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and... What do you guys want to see? Do you want to see me just begin with a pre-assigned roster? Or do you want to see me go ahead and draft a new roster? And comment what you want me to take over, Raw or SmackDown. I personally like SmackDown, but um, every time I play, I feel like... Uh, Raw is always somewhat better. Um, I'm not 100% sure what you guys want me to do, but comment and let me know uh, if you want me to draft or use pre assigned and if you want to use SmackDown or Raw. Alright, I think we're going to go ahead and just draft a new roster. Um, oops. Okay, there's one. Yo, VT1 Gaming, thank you for the raid with three uh, viewers. I much appreciate it. This is the first raid. Thank you so much, uh, VT. Uh, if you guys can go ahead and give him a follow if you haven't already, please do so. Uh, looks like SmackDown's the second one. Okay, we'll do this one more time. Alright, looks like we're going to take over Raw. Uh, yep, we already know about this. SmackDown has a cruiserweight, Raw has a women's, cruiserweights are in blue, divas are in red. You are not required to draft all 20. Recommended is 12 to 20. Okay. Uh, so it looks like we'll get first pick. Um... Thanks, Broken Sanity. Glad to have you guys. Uh, obviously, I think our first pick is going to be Batista. Um, we have $10 million for the cap. I'll go ahead, because he's probably going to be one of my top guys, I'll go ahead and sign him to a, a six-month contract. Ooh, damn, they took Triple H. All right. Well, they took Triple H, so we're going to go ahead and take... You know what? Um, 
There we go. That's what I wanted. We're going to take Undertaker to Raw, and we'll sign him to three months. And then we will go ahead and take... We'll take John Cena three months. They took Ray, which is actually who I was going to take next. Um, you know what? We will take... Ugh. Kind of just got to go for the popularity right now. Because I want some people that will bring enough popularity. Um, yeah, we'll go with Sean for six months. And then we will take... You know what, let's draft a D.Va really quick. Trish, Stacy, Tori, Lita, Christy, Michelle. You know what, we're just going to go ahead and take Trish. We'll take her for three months. And then we will go ahead and take Chris Benoit for six. And they took Paul London. I gotta take Edge. Uh, three months. And then give me Christian for six. Because uh, we have Edge and Christian. Uh, we can do a tag team with them at some point. Um, they took Kane. We'll take Big Show for... Ugh. His overall is 82, but his popularity is 66. We'll do... We'll do three months for Big Show. And then I would like Chris Jericho f for five weeks. And then Shelton Benjamin for three months. And then we'll sign Stacy Keebler for three months. Tori Wilson for five weeks. Our 14th pick will be Chavo Guerrero for three months. Our next pick... Mm, do we dare go for the Basham brothers? Hmm. You know what? Let's do this. Let's go Scotty to Hottie. Go with the Bashams? Alright. Doug Basham. What? How long should I keep him for then? Should I keep him for five or three months? A year? Five weeks? Yeah, we'll do five weeks. And then Danny for five weeks. There we go. We got the Bashams, guys. Alright, we have... Four more picks. We have these are our options left. We have William Hindenrick, Chris Masters, Grenier, Scotty Tuhati, Conway, Snitsky, Richards, Hurricane, Michelle McCool, Spike Dudley, Charlie Haas. Go for Chris Masters. You know what, VT, just for you. Uh bring in the raid. We'll go with Chris Masters. And just for you. We will go ahead and sign him for, we'll go for six months. And then, hmm, Broken Sanity, Mark Jendrick. Oh, what the hell? Hold on. Uh, let me fix that really quick. Nightbot shouldn't be doing that. Uh, disable, disable, 
Uh, disable. All right, there you go. Uh, VT, it should be all set now. You shouldn't be getting uh, timed out anymore. Um, so Mark Jindrick, is that who you guys think I should go with next? Is Mark Jindrick? Broken Sanity says yes with an exclamation point. Um, all right, we'll only keep him for five weeks um, since he's not that big of a guy. Um, next. Uh, hold on, how many... How many, let's see, I have one, two, three, three women. Should I take another female or should I just go ahead and take my last two as actual male? Let's put Lita in there. Uh, three months. And then our last pick. Ooh, we got some uh, some good names in here. All right. What do you guys think? Should I do Hurricane, Charlie Haas, Scotty Too Hotty, or should I go and use um, Regal or Carlito? Carlito has a better overall and better popularity than Regal. But Regal would be a cheaper contract. You know what? We're going to go with... Yeah, I know who you are, Sanity. I just get used to saying people's uh, Twitch names. So, um, Alright, we'll take Regal. And we'll go ahead and sign him to six months. Yes. All right. Um. Do we want to? Do we want to leave them vacant, or do we want to go ahead and assign people to them? Because honestly, I feel like we should leave them vacant and our first show just be some build up to either the championship match or have at least a championship match. Random? What do you mean, random? How do you randomize it? Just do like what I'm doing, like this? Or leave it vacant? Okay. Alright, we'll do three spins. Alright. Well, actually, you know what? We'll do one spin. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold it down until you guys say stop. When you guys say stop, whoever it lands on will be the WWE champion. Ready? Three, 
two, one, spin. Chris Benoit. Do you guys like that option or do you want me to spin one more time? All right. Chris Benoit is our WWE champion. World Tag Team Champions. All right, so the first champion. Here we go. Same principle. Just say stop when ready. All right, so there's Undertaker. All right, now for his tag partner. Chris Jericho. All right. So it looks like Undertaker and Chris Jericho will be our tag team champions. Now the Intercontinental is next. Shawn Michaels. You guys okay with that one? Perfect. <laughs> All right, and now our women's. So we have Trish, Tori, Stacy, and Lita. So here we go. Trish Stratus. I'm good with that one. All right, Marksman Army. This is what we got for our champions of Monday Night Raw. We have our WWE champion is Chris Benoit. Our world tag team champions are Undertaker and Y2J Chris Jericho. Our intercontinental champion is HBK Shawn Michaels. And our women's champion is none other than Trish Stratus. If you guys are okay with it, I'm okay with it. And I'm ready to get the show going. Alright guys, this is it. This is our champions. I'm set on it. I hope you guys are too because I'm not going to change anything. Here we go. Brand is raw. Setting okay. Yes. Alright, so we have our first thing from Mr. McMahon. 
I would like to be the first to congratulate you on your new position as general manager. As the chairman of the board, I want to make sure you are well aware that the WWE is all about the fans. That is why you have a job, and your job is to grow your show's fan base. This will not be easy, as the other GM will be fighting for the same fans. At the end of the year, I will award the show that has the most fans with the GM of the Year award. The highest honor as general manager can can receive. If you need information about the day-to-day activities of the general manager, check out the JR slash Taz report in the weekly report section at your desk. Good luck. Alrighty. So we are in Helena, Montana. It is April Fool's Day. Uh, yep. Alright. Uh, we have an email from JR. If you need any help figuring out any of the general manager's duties, then feel free to check out my report in this uh, report section. Perfect. Thank you. All right, guys. So this is our roster. We have a good stack of people. Um, we have the Basham brothers. We have Edge and Christian uh, that could be going towards the tag team championships. We have Chavo, we have uh, Chris Masters, Mark Jendrick, Regal, Shelton, uh, I think it said Shelton, um, Big Show, Chris Benoit. We have all these guys that uh, we could potentially have a really good show. Uh, we have no rivalries right now, um, but maybe here in a little bit we will... Um, try and do that. We still have a good chunk of people on um, free agency, so there might be some changes to come. Who knows? Um, reports, obviously, there's none. Leading into WrestleMania, well, we're going towards SummerSlam, then Survivor Series, then Royal Rumble, then WrestleMania. Um, JR's reports, there's going to be nothing right now so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and get going our promos right away I'm gonna be doing some advertising um, just so that we can get our money going but our first match of the night is singles match no manager and it's gonna be uh, da, 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 da. You know what? Uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and do Chris Masters, but instead of Chavo. Uh, yeah, we'll do William Regal. So our first match of the night will be Chris Masters versus William Regal. And then we're going to have a women's battle between Lita and Stacy Keebler. Match three is going to be a tag team match. Actually, yeah, tag team match, tornado tag team match. And we're going to have Undertaker and Y2J going against the Bashams. There we go. Hmm. Should the Bashams go ahead and get a title opportunity first night, or should we make them wait? Part of me feels like a title match might be handy. What do you guys want to see? Do you guys want to see a title title match right away? Sure. 
Sure, Broken Sanity says. <laughs> All right. So we'll do the tag team. Yep. Okay. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Match type. Do normal tag. Chris Jericho. No. Uh, how do I make it for the title, though? That's the question. I'm just missing it. Am I missing something? Like, how do I make it a, Is it like that? Hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to make it a title match. Don't know what I'm missing. Oh, okay, there we go. I see what where it's at. Thank you. Okay. Whew, I was worried there for a second. Alright, match four. Will be a triple threat. Between Actually, no, we're not going to do Batista. We will do... John Cena. Yeah, let's do that. John Cena versus Big Show versus Chavo Guerrero. Triple threat match. Match five. We'll do another women's... And this one will be Tori, or I mean Trish versus Tori. There we go. And then our main event. Um, let's do. We'll just do a single Chris Benoit versus Batista. Uh, oh, shit. I just realized something. We're going to change this up. It's going to be single, no manager. Yeah, we'll do these two right here for the Intercontinental Championship. 
Um, Chris Benoit and Batista will not be for the title this week. Potentially next week. All right. So this is our card before we uh, hit ready. We have match number one, Chris Masters versus William Regal. Then we'll have Lita versus Stacey Keebler, not Kleebler. Uh, then tag team championships are on the line. Uh, the Bashams will be taking on Y2J and Undertaker. And then we have a triple threat between Cena, Chavo, and Big Show. Then our co-main event of the evening will be an Intercontinental Championship match between Shawn Michaels and Mark Jendrick. And our main event will be a singles non-title match between the WWE Champion Chris Benoit and Batista. I th think that's going to be a good first Raw right there. So we're going to go ahead and hit ready. Are you... You are about to advance to the show. All right, guys. Do you think that was a good card, or do you want me to change something up before I continue? All right. Jesse, aka Broken Sanity, says good to go. So you know what? We're good to go. Alright. I'm I'm probably not gonna watch any of these just because I don't really feel like watching them right now. But we'll go ahead and we'll I'll decide towards the end. Um, so Chris Masters versus William Regal, and William Regal comes out on top. Lita versus Stacy Keebler. Wow, Stacy Keebler actually won that one. Um, you know what? We'll go ahead and watch this one. This is the uh, World Tag Team Championship match. Now, there's a chance I may have to change the graphics and stuff um, just due to the emulator sometimes lagging so if there's any sort of uh, weird um, look or something to it I'm just gonna be messing with it for a minute so I'll I apologize beforehand So we got Danny Basham for, uh, starting out with, against The Undertaker. Ooh, there was a glit. Yep. Jericho is legal. Ooh. So far, the Bashams have been kind of in control here. Undertaker comes in to try and break it up, but Jericho escaped it. Ooh, Jericho with a hard, hard hit. Not Jericho, uh, Undertaker. Trying to go for another submission, but once again, Jericho is able to escape. Danny with the tag to Doug. I'm sorry if my um, overlay is a little off, guys. Um, I don't know why it's acting like it is. There we go. There. 
That's the best I can do. Ooh, Danny's getting some uh, damage done to him, guys. Uh, OBS. I'm actually using uh, Streamlabs OBS uh, app right now. OBS just seemed to uh, run a little smoother for me compared to XSplit, honestly. Danny and Undertaker on the outside. We're already to a three count, four count. This may or may not end in a count out. Oh, nope, there we go. They're both back inside. Undertaker stores his finisher. Yeah, that was another thing, is I didn't want to really do a subscription thing, and OBS was free, and I use Streamlabs a lot, um, for, like, my Twitch alerts type of stuff, so I figured this made more sense, and it, it seems to be running a lot better than just straight OBS, so I'd highly recommend it. Tombstone pile driver on Doug Basham. Oh, rope break, unfortunately, with Undertaker going for that cover up. Undertaker also losing a lot of stamina. Yeah, Streamlabs just seems to work a little bit more better for me um, for everything. So that's just kind of my all thinking. I don't have a camera yet, unfortunately, so I have to use my logo I, I'll admit I did love the X split interface but like I said I just wanted to go with OBS because I know how to use it a lot better but it's everybody's preference Rope break. This is a pretty good uh, matchup so far. I'm not too bad. I'm not too. Uh, what was I gonna say? <laughs> I'm not too uh, like unsatisfied with it. I'm pretty satisfied with the back and forth of it. Danny's got his finisher. Once again, guys, if you haven't done so already, please drop a follow. Please drop a sub. It would mean uh, the world to me if I could get my first sub. Um, once again, thank you to VT1 Gaming for the raid. Thank you to Broken Sanity for the follow. Greatly appreciate it, guys. Um, means a lot to me uh, to actually have some interaction during my streams. It's It's been a while since I've had some interaction. Um, so, yeah, it means a lot. So, thank you, guys. I don't know why it says currently playing Monster Cat <laughs> down in the bottom. Um, I'm not playing Monster Cat. I'm trying to get it to coincide with Nightbot, but for some reason it doesn't want to work with Nightbot. So, But I do have song requests um, available, guys. If you just put in exclamation point... Songs request. 
uh, and then the name of the song, um, or you can do it with the link, usually. Uh, it will go ahead and play the audio for the music. Sometimes it takes it a little while, and sometimes I have to adjust it, but if you guys want a song requested, you are more than welcome to do so. Just make sure it's uh, nothing annoying like Barbie Girl or something like that. I will uh, stop the audio for it. So, Ooh, going for that submission again. Man, this is a good matchup going on eight, almost eight minutes. Uh, Jericho's pretty beat up and Danny's pretty beat up. Nobody wants to, to lose this matchup. Chris Jericho and Undertaker being the uh, tag champs going into this matchup. And the Bashams uh, challenging right away. First week of Raw. First show, actually, of the year. And they're going all out. They're saying, we want the tag team championships. We want the title opportunity tonight. So, your boy gave them a title opportunity and so far, I'm very pleased with how things are going. These two teams are going back and forth just well. And I think we are experiencing one of the greatest matches so far. Ooh, Jericho with a flying uh, moonsault, it looked like. Or maybe that was a front flip. I, couldn't, I caught it like right at the end. I just seen someone flying. Up to a count of four. Both superstars re-enter the ring. Doug quickly going with some advantage right there. Quickly throwing Jericho back out of the ring. Undertaker giving a boot to the back of the head to Doug. But Doug kind of shrugs it off to a certain degree. Count is going to be restarted because Doug exited the ring. Oh, Undertaker with a roll up. Also guys... Uh, I have it showing me right now that I'm already up to a thousand views, 109 followers, seven viewers. I greatly appreciate it, guys. We've been streaming for almost an hour. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to stream too much longer tonight because it's already midnight and I got to get up early in the morning uh, to do some stuff and then I got to go to work uh, around one. Ooh, excuse me. But um, I have two more days of work, and then it's my weekend. So Sunday night, guys, is probably going to be the next night that I'll be live if I if I don't do it tomorrow. Um, and I will definitely bring you guys episode two of SmackDown vs. Raw General Manager Mode. We're going to go ahead and finish out um, this card. Um... We have a couple more matches that we can either watch or simulate. And then we'll probably call it quits for the night. Um, once again, I greatly appreciate everybody stopping in. Please, please, please don't forget to sub and follow. It would be greatly appreciated. Um, if you sub, you will get this awesome emote that you can use wherever you want. Um... It's just my logo right now. I uh, will likely be like be on live tomorrow night with some extreme warfare revenge. Sounds good, VT. I look forward to it. Um, I'll definitely stop in and give you guys a host. Um, also, VT, thanks for uh, dropping the host on me. I just looked at the notification stuff, so thank you um, for the raid. Thank you for the hosting. Um, I'm looking forward to some more content from you guys. Um, but yeah, and I'm sorry if I'm not like interacting or, you know, talking about the game as much as I should be, but it's kind of new to me to be doing this. So I usually just play like Godfather or something like that. Bunch of you suck chants in the crowd. Ooh, got some frame droppage. Who's like, okay, so it's Doug and Undertaker. Doug really working on uh, Undertaker. Or, my bad, Danny. Not Doug. 
Doug going for a little bit of a choke. We might be getting close to the end here, guys. I don't know. Ooh, that tag team move on uh, Undertaker there. Unfortunately, Danny is just out of stamina. We'll see what he can do. Undertaker with a quick reversal and a quick co clothesline. What's Undertaker got in store here? He is gonna go with a couple with a couple of stomps to the leg. Doug already looking for the tag back in. Danny with a quick reversal on Undertaker and quick chop to the back. Quick tag in to Doug. Holy shit! Undertaker just flatlining freaking Doug Basham. Irish rip pull back. Ooh, there we go. Danny Basham getting yelled at by the referee to get out of the freaking ring right now. Doug Basham giving some nice blows to the Undertaker. Ooh, Undertaker quickly getting up. Oh, there's the tag. Oh, shit. <laughs> Undertaker's down. Ooh, drop kick to the back of the head. Quick tag. And backbreaker. Ugh. Man, that looked like that had to hurt. Danny Basham is now the legal participant along with Chris Jericho. We're going on 13 minutes just for this match, guys. This is crazy. I don't know if we'll ever see an end to this match. What's Danny got in mind? Doing some damage to that head. Oh, shit. Oh. If Undertaker wanted to came in, we might have seen some new champions right then and there, guys. Ooh. Ooh, Danny Basham's been not, er, uh, cut wide open. So both the Basham brothers are now split wide open. I believe Jericho's cut open. I know he's not. Not yet. He's close. All right, VT, thank you for stopping in, my man. Much appreciated. You have a good night. Be sure to follow and sub if possible. I'll catch you tomorrow, my man. Thanks again. Quick tag. That was a fail. This is just constant back and forth. I don't know, guys. Jericho with the roll up. Ah, oh. Doug coming in with the uh, uh, break up. can't tell what the crowd is something they're saying something sucks <laughs>
Undertaker looking for that tag. Oh, 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 oh. There it is, guys. We have some new tag team champions. The Basham Brothers have done it. They have made Chris Jericho tap out at around 15, 16 minutes into the match. Interesting. Alrighty, guys. That was the first mat or the tag team championship match, and we have some new tag team champions on Monday Night Raw. Um. Now we have Cena versus Guerrero versus Big Show. <laughs> of course. Seeing him being the goat comes out and takes the win in that one. Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and simulate the last two guys. Um, but we have Shawn Michaels versus Mark Jindrick in the Intercontinental Championship match. Oh my God, we have a new IC champion, Mark Jindrick has won the Intercontinental Championship. Wow. And then the singles match between Chris Benoit and Batista. And Batista wins. <laughs> 